Good morning, Rat Rod Bikers. This is a little different. I, for some reason, I tried uh, my wife's iPad for recording today, and uh, I didn't get any sound. So I'm narrating my video as I watch it now this evening at uh, 4.42 Central Daylight Time. It's a beautiful day out here. It's 65 degrees already around 11 a.m. when I shot this. Got a brand new rear skewer purple anodized and uh, installed in the bike now did a little bit of ratification on it to rough it up a, just enough to make it look a little bit older and take some of that deep deep purple out of it <clears throat> 70s rock choke implied anyway I've been working on the frame I uh, did a little research and found some ways to get raw aluminum polished and uh, that's what I've been working on uh, late last night and today. The top tube that we're looking at now has been sanded with 320, then 600 grit, then 2000. And, um, and then the polish has been applied, the homemade polish, which we'll get into in a bit. Notice the brazons even got nice and shiny. The down tube has um, just been sanded. So you can see it's fairly smooth. Um, we'll see a couple of little striations coming up. And then the seat tube hasn't been touched yet. So you can see the pock marks in there, the little uh, um, blemishes and some oxidation. And there's a shot of the top tube gleaming in the sun slash 75 uh, watt bulb and the non-addressed seat tube. Uh, I was listening to some jazz uh, sorry to say we're missing the jazz on this narration. Should have got my guitar out. Anyway, I um, reconfigured that old 40s Admiral radio um, to be able to play my phone and uh, through it. So, we yeah, had a little Pandora going this morning. The polish is con made from uh, cream of tartar, which you can get at any spice rack in your grocery store. Um... Equal amounts of cream of tartar and warm water. Mine got a little bit watery, but you can see the heavier residue in the bottom of that bowl. And I dipped my rag in there, got some of the residue on there, and wiped it on the frame. And then I followed with a wet sponge to rinse off the residue from the tartar. And there are my <coughs> sandpaper pieces. Um, those two are the 320 and the 2000. Um, just enough to raise the aluminum. It was my first time ever actually sanding metal. Usually I'm rusting it. But uh, this guy, you use it a few times and it's so smooth that it's just like, like a piece of uh, oil paper. But I, I'm happy with the result. And uh, it was a gorgeous day here in the back 40. We'll see you next time.